Hey guys, so I'm gonna be making the crispy rice with spicy tuna. And you know, I first had this dish in San Francisco a while back at a restaurant called Chad Brasserie, and I loved it so much because I just thought that the textures and the flavors were so good. And you know, I went home and I tried to replicate it, and I thought it turned out pretty good, so I just kinda wanted to show you guys my version of it. First, start by roughly chopping a pound of fresh sushi-grade ahi tuna. Then put it in the food processor and pulse it until it is finely chopped into a soft consistency. Next in a bowl, I'll add in two tablespoons sriracha sauce, one tablespoon sesame oil, one teaspoon hot chili oil, and a quarter cup of mayo. Then just mix it all together and your sauce is ready. You can refrigerate it until it's ready to use. Now it's time to start on the crispy rice. This is a mold that will make it easy to shape the rice into rectangles. You can find this at a Japanese grocery store or online. I'll put a link to one in the description box down below. First, you want to pack the rice into the mold. You want to put a lot of rice in here and pack it very tightly. Otherwise, the pieces won't hold their shape and just kind of fall apart. Then use the cover to pack it in. To remove the rice from the mold, just flip it over and push on the little doors to have the rice come out. Once you have your rice shaped into rectangles, you want to lightly cook them over medium heat with some sesame oil. When they begin to crisp, you want to brush them with some soy sauce on all sides, then cook for another two to three minutes until they are nice and browned. This is when you know if you packed the rectangles tight enough because um, when you start moving it around in the pan when you're cooking them, um, if you didn't pack them tightly enough, they will kind of start to fall apart and you might have to try this over. So it might take a little bit of practice in the beginning, but once you get it, you'll know for the next time how, how tightly to pack the rice. Now that the rice is cooked, it's time to assemble them. First, I'll start by mixing the spicy sauce and the ahi tuna. Now it's time to assemble them. Just get a small spoon and top the crispy rice with the tuna mixture. Use the back of the spoon to press and shape each piece. Then brush the top with unagi sauce. And finally, garnish with green onion. Now let me just try one of these. Mmm. That is really good. You really get that texture, that crispiness with the creamy spicy tuna. It's really good. I need another bite. I think I've outdone myself. Now, if you want this recipe, you can go to KevinKimura.cooking. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe to my channel. Bye.